guys and what's up and welcome back to my channel so before you forget make sure you subscribe make sure you press on that bell so you know when I next do a video it's May the 7th well it won't be May the 7th when you're watching it it's a very good super moon tonight it gives you a great opportunity to recharge and cleanse all your crystals and all your other bits and bobs that I haven't told you a lot about while we're at home crystals is a great way to help with anxiety motivation just because we have missed this day doesn't mean there's no more coming up make sure you grab yourself a lunar calendar that normally tells you all the moon cycles you can always check online on the moon phases just make sure you put down your well, where you're living. So you guys have probably seen me doing crystal baths and I think it's a great way to get all the crystal properties into the water and then bathed onto you. Or you've seen me drinking my water bottles with crystals in the middle of it. So I am a huge crystal believer. I've loved crystals since I was a kid. <laughs> I thought I'd take you guys along with me and maybe give you some tips and tricks. I've been doing this kind of stuff for pretty much so many years and I do it in different techniques as well. There's different ways doing it. You're gonna get some people saying, no, you don't do it that way. You do it the way you like my mum is watching something very strange on TV. I'm telling you, if it's um, <clears throat> in this house, off. Oh, what is wrong with you? Anyway, guys, we're gonna pop you on this. I'm gonna grab me crystals on this big, gigantic. You'll see it when you see it. It's hideous. So because my room is still under construction, a lot of my big ones have gone upstairs and it's... I don't like going up there. <laughs> so I've got so many to-go crystals, like... It's embarrassing. Do you know what? Whenever I go to a club and then they search my bag, they look at me and I look at them and I think, why are you looking at me like that? And they're looking at me and like, why the f*** have you got a stone in your bag? Yeah, it happens all the time. <laughs> And obviously, I wear tons of crystal. There's no way you'll see me with no crystal on me. So the sun is setting, the moon will probably be coming up. Yeah, so come along with me while I cleanse and charge my crystals. Oh, guys, we are almost ready to go. Okay, I do see this dish being a little bit excessive. I really like it. I think it's really nice for. Oh, that way, done. <laughs> So we've got from pendulums, we've got wands, we've got hundreds of tumble stones. I love opalite. Who loves opalite more than me? This is fantastic. This is the first way you can actually cleanse and charge all your crystals. Just rest this with them. But I normally use this for physical reasons. I put this by the bath if you've seen it in my vlogs. And this is fantastic. They're very inexpensive. I don't advise you to put them in the bath, just on the side of the bath because this you know when you smash your iPhone and the screen's cracked? And if you put your face or your hand over the screen and you've got that like glass residue, that's exactly what melts off of this. So do not put this in your bath water because if it ends up on your skin, ouch. Also, I've got to take these off. So you're better off just to roll them off like that and you don't snap the elastic. We've got lots more crystals around the house. So, bitch has got a lot of work to do. So guys, the first thing you're going to do is, um, well, take them outside. Oh, look at that sunset. Oh, God, isn't it beautiful? Anyway, so now it's time to just nicely put them out. I like to just give them a little bit of space. And I just like to have a bit of fun with it because um, we're stuck indoors. And I had nothing else better to do. And also, I'm going to grab my runes. I totally forgot to tell you that. I do do runes. So I'm just going to pop all these out because they're all rose quartz, so they need to be cleansed and stuff too. Never in my life I like to use runes until I found these on eBay, I think. Don't you just love laying all your crystals out and just look at them? And then I like to put my cell night on the middle for some weird reason. <laughs> and these are my prayer beads I actually made myself because... I find homemade ones a lot better, and the ones that you can buy online, they're not cheap. So this one I bought for my mum and dad is for when they're travelling. So this is literally my favourite pendulum ever. It's made by Moonstone and it's by the Psychic Tree. Oh, I love these two bracelets so much. I feel naked without them on. <laughs> So in case you don't know, I have this water bottle where you fill it in with like these pendulums filled with crystals and obviously they need to be cleansed too. Each one is different and oh, they're just gorgeous. They're by a company called Bee Water, so check them out. After this, it's always good to make an offering and I like to feed the birds at the moment because 
boom, there you have it. Because the birds at the moment, I obviously assume they're not being fed a lot at the moment these sort of times. Get ready to watch this awful throw. <laughs> oh, guys, look at the sunset. So we're going to leave these out overnight and we're going to have some happy birds and happy crystals. So, good night. So there you go. How pretty are they in the sun? Honestly, oh, I love them so much. Anyway, guys, do not forget to put all the crystals back where they originally were, such as in little pouches, in your purse, in your bag. And there you have it. Nice, happy, charged, cleansed crystals ready for you to use again. I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I hope you're staying at home, staying safe. Guys, tell me down below, what's your favourite crystal? Anyway, guys, I love you so much, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.